I gotta say, it'd be really nice if the game actually like stayed on or like opened while I was recording, but I don't think it's in the cards. So yeah, we're in the factory. We got the we got the we got the mistake tolerance thingy. I guess. Oh, this is a hard one, isn't it? Huh. I guess I can just do that. Huh. Very nice. We like it. Um. So I have been. What have I been talking about? You know what I've been talking about? I talked about my. Uh... Oh, cool. They're just gonna. Is that the dog? Am I... Am I hearing the dog right now? Is that the dog in me? That's the dog in me. Anyways. What am I... What the heck am I saying? Oh, no! Oh! There we go. There we go. We did it, guys. We'll worry about the dog later. I'm not even gonna... not even gonna think about the dog right now. That's the... Not the dog in me. I'm gonna... I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, oh boy, I'm gonna. Well, okay, we well, you know it's not that, huh? Well, I guess something more akin to this. Um, I kind of have to start like this, sort of. Or do I? Also, I think I've mentioned this before, but does anybody else kind of hear the, oh, this works. Hear the, um, uh, okay, I don't know if my volume on this is loud enough for that to really be audible, but does anybody else hear the, uh, um, Talking Heads, uh, Letting the Day Go By song uh, ever so often, kind of in the background? And just, just the opening, the part where they go like, Hey, lips raising, very nice. Oh, that makes sense. That's uh, one of them, their uh, control puzzles. It's not very difficult, it just does the environment. Anyways, I've been talking about... What have I been talking about? Um, oh! Uh, oh. How's that gonna work? Huh. Well, that's got to be visible from somewhere, right? Probably way the heck up there. Unless this breaks at some point. Who knows? So, let's see. On Batman, I talked about... Uh, well, I said I wasn't going to talk about it again, so actually, no, I didn't talk about anything. Oh, okay. Huh. You can change them from here. That's interesting. Actually, I kind of like that. Oh! Weird. That did change. Well, I guess... I mean, I know this is an environmental puzzle, but I figure that's got a... Eesh. What the heck is that? What? What is divine and um, is elusive and impalpable. And he is easily tempted to embody it in a concrete form. A uh. church, a country, a social system, a leader so that he may realize it with less effort and serve it with more profit. Yet, the attempt to externalize the kingdom of heaven in a temporal shape must end in disaster. It cannot be created by charters or constitutions, nor established by arms. Those who seek for it alone will reach it together, and those who seek it in company will perish by themselves. Hugh King's Mill, 1944. Okay. They mentioned concrete in there. Isn't that fun? Well, uh, yeah. I guess I'll get to use the stairs this episode. That's nice. Anyways. Uh, who could have seen that one coming? I was not expecting voice acting in this game. Let alone collectibles. Like, that came out of left field for me. Um, uh, yeah. That's, oh, jeez. I don't even know how to kind of process what just happened there. Um, oh, well, this is simple enough. Uh, this is slightly less simple, except not really. 
Oh, okay, now they're gonna throw something hard at us. The Royal Us. The, um... Right. Crap. Now, do I want to exclude red or include red? No. I think it's gonna be this. Never mind. That's that's not right at all. That's that's not correct. As a matter of fact. Who? I bet. You know what? This? No. That's that's not gonna work neither. Oh jeez. You know that would be really nice if it worked, but it ain't gonna. You know, I I really ought get to the point in these episodes sooner than I do. Because I, I all too often just don't get to the point in these episodes in anything. I don't know why the heck not, because it's not like I set myself out to talk about some, like, uber-difficult material or anything, you know. Um, 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 this is basically the same as last time. It'd be really nice if it worked. Uh, what was it? Right, I was going to talk about number eight. The uh, quote-unquote final track, even though I already said, I mean, I already, I already said there was going to be a bonus track, so I can't really say final track, you know, for brick by brick. And it's going to be, you know, what I'm, I, I guess I'll just say it outright. I was going to make, uh, oh, this almost works. This almost works. This just barely doesn't work. It's going to be. Um, Blink-182, Aliens Exist. Hey, that works. Uh, let's see, what else? Um, I guess it, it sticks, right? Roboto? Or, uh, Mr. Roboto? I think, I'm pretty sure it sticks. Mr. Roboto. And the Ben-10 Thief. <laughs> Very ambitious, I know, and... Uh, it's probably going to go together maybe not very well, but I already made Come On Valerie, so, uh, you know, how can it go worse? I, I'm honestly, like, I already, I already talked about Come On Valerie, but uh, it's still disappointing to me. I made that, like, yesterday, you know, and it's again where I, I really should just give myself more time for these, but it, it's still disappointing when it comes together poorly or more poorly than I would have hoped. So, you know. Them's the brakes, I suppose. Oh, jeez, this is so close. Um, but, yeah. So, every time I listen to Mr. Roboto by Styx, they get to the part where it's like, bow, bow, and I immediately think of the Ben 10 theme. And upon thinking of the Ben 10 theme, I thought, you know, Let's really balance this out with something else relating to aliens. Also, I need a uh, Lego Rock Band song in there. So, boom, Blink-182, Aliens Exist. And honestly, I don't remember that song going as hard as it does, but boy, does that song go hard. It, it is, uh, it, it's hard. It, it's hard as frig, man. <laughs> so... Uh, it'd be so nice if I could just, like, not worry about these. Is that constant? Hold on. Does it always do that? Okay, it seems to want to fix that one, so let's just, you know, see if we can make that one the one that fixes, or whatever. Then again, I say that. I'm not sure how I would go about doing it, because I would have to be able to overlap, and I can't, unfortunately. So, yeah, how about that? Ain't that something? Um, uh, what I could do? Wait, am I silly goofy? I could just do this. Yeah, oh, geez, multiple colors. That's quite something in it. I mean, there's just that. I could just do that. Did that have any bearing on the environment? Because there's... it's not like...
I don't see what I would have done, but, you know, it's not like this has only one solution here. I can do the same dang thing over here, you know? Sort of. Like that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it'd be, it'd be, it'd be really awkward if I just, you know, didn't do it right. Uh, oh, jeez. Uh, uh, that's difficult. This is just the Chrome logo. Hold on. This is Google Chrome. Google Chrome puzzle. There we go. All right, we have done it, fellows. Is this, does this lead anywhere? Uh, I don't know. I guess we'll check outside. Or not? For one, I kind of do want this ramp to be up, to be honest. Oh! Oh, it changes both. That's why. Okay, that makes sense, I guess. Huh. Well, uh, that's alright. I suppose. Uh, uh, I sure did this the wrong way, didn't I? I feel like the thought process there was almost correct, but just not quite. How exactly do I go about even... Like, there's not... In my head, there's not a really good way of actually subdividing these. You know? And there's only one... I guess something like this? Yeah, that works. But where does it... What, what all does it affect? I'm honestly surprised how well we're going through this uh, area. But, you know... Oh, cool, there's sand and stuff. There's sand and stuff? Aw, oh, dang, you're telling me I can't go through the sand? Uh, right, okay. Let's just go down the stairs. Let's take the stairs. We did the stairs puzzle. We, we dropped the stairs. We listened to the... I already forgot this guy's name. I, I probably should remember the guy's name, because it sounded like important dialogue, but it's, you know... Honestly, I really was not uh, expecting religious commentary out of this game, but, you know, not, not a, a wholly unwelcome surprise, I suppose. Hey, this, very nice. Oh, right, okay. What does it do? All right, I'm just gonna assume that doing this in reverse has the opposite effect. We're moving? We are moving! Alright, we're going down, actually. We were able to get over here anyways, but, you know, and now we have a... I guess an easier path, I suppose. Unless I'm supposed to be on the lookout for... something round. Did I really never lower the dock over here? Am I... Am I have the stupid... Don't answer that. Huh. Also, I have no idea how exactly I'm supposed to... Oh, Hold on. I gotta send this back up. I think this is something we gotta do as we're lowering. Alright, makes a lot of sense. I'll, uh... Speed this up a little bit, huh? Okay, let's try this again. Whee! Here we go! 
It's going to slowly but surely work, I'm sure. I don't see why not. I mean, this seems to be kind of the only way to actually do this. Also, I totally called it, too. I was like, oh, I bet we're going to have to... We're going to have to do some kind of environmental puzzle when I, on the way down. Lo and behold, this game is very consistent, and I do like that in a game. And, uh, you know, we'll slowly but surely get there. I guess I really could just wait until I'm at the bottom here. Probably. But, you know, I've missed the ends of puzzles before, so... Not going to risk that. Whee! There it goes. Off to the nearest obelisk, I suppose. And where did that other line end up? You know, uh, uh, I know I said, uh, you know, we're gonna, uh, we're gonna lower the dock, but, uh, no, we're not. Yes, we are. Oh, wait, no, that, that leads to the, the laser beam thingy. Maybe we will, maybe we will finish this area, but I do actually want to lower the dock first. Though, we're probably gonna come over here later, so... Yeah, this is a bunch of its own puzzles. Never mind, never mind. We're gonna do the dock uh, at a later date, unfortunately. I guess not really unfortunately. Unfortunately or fortunately. And right now, we got a big old box waiting for us somewhere. I guess I have to go this direction. Great, great, I did it. I did it in the bass backwards way. Bass backwards kind of way. Fun, fun, fun. But, yeah, uh, don't, don't think that I really believe that, um, the Ben 10 theme is gonna mix well with something like, um, Aliens Exist and Mr. Roboto. I think Aliens Exist and Mr. Roboto might mix well. And, in all honesty, I only have the Ben 10 theme because that one part in, in, uh, Mr. Roboto reminds me of it. Oh, okay, never mind, we're not doing the box right now. Don't tell me. I do have to do the dock first. Oh my gosh, we gotta do the boathouse. Well, uh, we'll do that on the next episode. I'm gonna, I guess, continue to talk about, um, Mr. Roboto, Ben 10. Uh, I'm not gonna tell you what I'm gonna call it yet, because I want that to be the, the only surprise, I suppose. But, you know, uh, I'll just say that Ben 10 really is the, uh, the bridging factor here between aliens and robots. And that's all I'm gonna say. Because I could have just done um, Aliens Exist in Mr. Roboto and then called it, like, Robots vs. Aliens or something. But that would have been lame. So, you know, to really up the cool factor, I put in a... God, how old is that cartoon? Okay, never mind. We can just, oh, we can just lower the boat anyways. Cool. Yeah, I really should have seen that one coming. Well, we're still going to do this. Just not right this second. Alright. On the next episode. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. I don't know what I'm looking at. This might be a bit higher level than I'm at right now, but, uh... We're still gonna do it on the next episode. Till then, though, like, comment, and subscribe. Or else. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.